though it's big, brutal, supercharged ZL1 brothers have made most of the headlines lately, they're obviously not the only V8 Camaro around Chevy still builds and sells the Camaro SS, and it still has a seriously potent pushrod V8 making 455 horsepower, a number that outdid the Mustang GT until this year, and even now it's only a difference of 5 horsepower at in some excellent handling, and you have one of the most compelling V8 sports cars on the market the example we test drove was in many ways the ideal enthusiast car. It was a well-equipped 2SS model, the top trim level, and the V8 was coupled to a 6-speed manual transmission it was suspended by GM's Magic Magnetic Ride Control suspension and came with Chevy's new Redline package, which adds black and red accents all around the car altogether, our Camaro came to a not-so-cheap $47,530 editor-in-chief Greg Migliori, the Chevy Camaro is a lot of carry kept thinking that as I peered around the blocky pillars and looked out over the long hood but that's a good thing it's muscular yet also sophisticated, agile and powerful. I love the Turbo 4 Chevy is offering in the Camaro. But every time I drive an SS like this one, I realize that's the way I'd go if I were in the market a V8 Camaro is just irresistible the manual transmission has long throws, but it's precise, and the clutch action is nicely calibrated it's an engaging, rewarding drive experience the Camaro feels good in corners, the chassis is tight, but not crazy abusive and it's miles ahead of the last generation's dynamics the car has a buff look it's a subtle change compared with its predecessor, though I think it's better tailored. The creases just seem to hang in a better, more confident manner and the front end sort of sneers at you my only complaint is the interior is a little plain the materials don't feel great, but the layout and the design is smart overall, the modern Camaro is in a good place it's well rounded, attractive and compelling the best part of waking up? Uh, at Chevrolet Camaro in front of the house epic.twitter.com slash SCKSXFC1H3, Greg Migliori, at Greg Migliori, September 29, 2017 Senior Producer Eddie Sabatini, This was my first time behind the wheel of the Camaro it was fun. I immediately I noticed the limited visibility, which made it seem like the vehicle is all blind spots but I was having a bad week so I decided to withhold judgment and just drive to clear my head, and this car delivered one of the most enjoyable times I've had in recent memory I took this SS onto the expressway, up and down Woodward Avenue and through the drive through 